Welcome to the November, a little bit of December, Fat Fiber sampler, sampler Box preview video. This month we are, our theme is Cinnamon Spice and Everything Nice. And our contributors have done a beautiful job to celebrate this theme. So first we'll start off with Fairy Tale Wool. She has sent us these beautiful fibers all the way from Canada. This is, um, let's look at the listing here. This is Rashmi's Curry. It's an art braid, she calls it. This is all naturally dyed fine merino, Romney, Icelandic, Corydale, and Tussa silk. So all of that's in here. It's super soft and luxurious and beautiful. Um, there's just a bit of sparkle. It looks, oh, maybe not. Yeah, I think that's the silk. Oh, wow, I thought that was um, nylon or Angelina, but it is silk. So beautiful fibers, and um, we're really happy that she joined us for this month. Next, we have Symphony Fibers, and this one, she called it Pumpkin Pie, and it is 50% Surrey Alpaca, and 50% Wakaya alpaca, alpaca. And she, um, again, did a beautiful job of giving, the, giving us these rich autumn oranges and soft browns, and it's super soft. This would be a delight to spin. I definitely recommend you'll, I think you're gonna want more of this, but you're gonna love it if you get this in your box. So this is a piece of felt. It's from Bluegate Alpaca Farms. They do wholesale alpaca dryer balls, felted sheets of alpaca, and insoles for shoes. And I thought this little sample would be perfect, just a coaster for your teacup in the winter time. So this will give you an idea of what their felt is like. And then you can, you can use it. I might crochet a little border on the edge of this just to make it a little bit bigger. But I thought it was a fun little sample for us to get in the box. Alice at Handmade Hollows sent us this one. She called them cinnamon rolls. This is Dorset, Polypay, and Gulf Coast Native. So these ones are super soft and fluffy. I think these would be fun to spin um, no matter what your skill level is. Let's see what we've got here. Because it's not too, these aren't too short of a stapling. So this would be fun and it wants to draft out beautifully. I love it. And I'd love to see how this, I will love to see how this spins up. This is, um, what I show you in the video is actually my box, my contributor box each month. So this is what I get to spin and um, everything I share with you I get to spin up and play with. This one is from Wild Hair Studio. This is Mom's Spice Cabinet. And every time I touch their fibers I want to spin them. I actually. I can't resist these beautiful fibers. Wild Hair Studio always sends us amazingly soft and large fluffy samples. Um, this one contains purebred Rommeldale CVM wool from their farm. This is Mer and it has merino, sari silk, bamboo, tussa silk, and angelina because you can see the little sparklies throughout there. So it's got a lot of luxury fibers and it's got some sparkle. This kind of has everything all in one. This gorgeous super softness is from Plum Crazy Fiber Art. And this, she, she called this Hot Cocoa and Marshmallows. It's 25% baby alpaca, oh, 25% each of baby camel, merino, baby alpaca, and mulberry silk. So all four of those equally are divided into this beautiful, soft, luxurious little sample. Her samples are always luxury fibers and we love having them in the box. We haven't had Queen Conk in our in our box in a little while. This time she sent us Cinnamon Chai Latte. And this is 100% CVM, California Variegated Mutant. And it's got some bronze sparkle and hologram Angelina in there and it's super soft. She said she's inspired by creamy cinnamon lattes, which sounds delicious right now. But yeah, she's got just a, just a bit of sparkle in there, and this is so soft. You know this just wants to be spun. Again, the CVM wool is such a wonderful fiber for 
soft, fluffy, warm wool to spin. Definitely want, look forward to spinning that baby up because that is beautiful. This is from Wonderland Fiber. So this one I did with um, Merino, Corydale, and this one doesn't even have sparkle in it. So it's just, and I did actually put some silk in there. Well, since I made it, we can, we can tear it up a little bit. Down in here, you'll see there's Tussa silk all throughout, hand-dyed Tussa silk. So these are all um, domestic wool fibers and um, Tussa silk. And I had a lot of fun making those. That one's kind of a monster size. This one's a little smaller, but the browns and greens in there just said fall to me. We have another cinnamon roll. This one is from Kitty Minecrafts. And this beautiful fingering weight yarn is 55% superwash BFL wool and then 45% silk. So you can see the shine, the shimmer of the silk in there. And it's got all these beautiful browns and cream colors. Fabulous. I think it looks like it would be a delight to knit. And I've been knitting more lately, so this really just, it tickles my fancy. I think it's beautiful. This luscious dark fiber came to us from Used to You. And it's, she called this a California Red. And it's super fluffy and soft. The picture on the video is not quite as dark as it is in real life. It is, there you can kind of see it a little better. It's a really deep dark brown with a, almost a hint of red in it. Really beautiful. And she included a little cinnamon candy for us too. But I love her big beautiful samples. This is used to you. This sample is from Poly Art Girl Designs. This is my other shop. This is where I do a lot of de-stash because I have a whole bunch of fibers I'm going to be de-stashing and doing drop bottom prices for this because I need to, to have a little bit less fiber in the studio if I'm going to be able to move around. This one I have a blended bamboo fiber and some domestic wool, some merino, and some Corydale in here, and then Angelina Sparkle. So this is just a blend of several different de-stash fibers. If you ever get one of my samples and then you go to buy more and it's not listed, just send me a note because um, sometimes I don't get around to listing it, but I do have the fibers in stock. This sample is from Jaeger and Yarn. She did these beautiful little brown, they almost look like glass. Little bits of sea glass or another kind of glass, but they're really beautiful little stitch markers on a nice big ring so that you can use them on your different size um, knitting needles. Beautiful little stitch markers for this month's box. This little cinnamon stick ornament it was sent to us by Phoenix Fiber Mill. So we've got a little cinnamon stick and a beautiful yarn hanger for it. A little bit of sparkle in there. And they sent us these for um, our cinnamon celebration. Absolutely love it. And I think I want to hang this. I don't know if I want to hang it on the tree or just hang it around the house. I love decorating for the holidays. This sample is from Gloria Patry. She sent us this hook place marker. So this can, you can use it to mark your place or the front and back of your work. And these cute little buttons that say, thank you for your love along with she always includes a candy to make it even more special. But she sent these for this month's box and I absolutely love these. Oh, there's Angelina everywhere. But yeah, love all that. And the little cinnamon, I mean the little gingerbread cookie is absolutely adorable. Thank you so much for joining me for this um, preview video. We will have something special for you in December. So keep an eye out for us because we will we're offering something very beautiful and special for our knitters and for our spinners. So take a look on our Instagram and you'll see it within the next two weeks because we want to do it early enough that you can buy the gift for yourself or you can buy the gift for somebody you love who's also a knitter and spinner. Um, then we'll come back in January for our 10th anniversary. We're so excited about that. So thank you for joining us. I hope you'll um, come back and join us again.